Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Shankar Chetty. I'm a general practitioner and natural science biologist from uh, sunny South Africa. Uh, I've been personally seeing COVID uh, illness, uh, long COVID and vaccine injuries over the past two to three years. And I'm, I'm interested in looking at all the collaboration that's occurred around the world and making it applicable to the patient in front of me. I hope to see you at our, at our conference in October. My name is Stephanie Seneff. I'm a senior research scientist at MIT, and I'm delighted to have an opportunity to speak to you about the spike protein, the mRNA vaccines, long COVID. Uh, my, my research is focused on trying to understand the mechanism by which we're getting such a toxic response uh, to this uh, virus and to the vaccine. And I'm specifically interested in the exosomes, the role of exosomes in transporting the mRNA around the body and also the role of the thymus gland is a new interest of mine. I hope to have some time to speak about that and how the, uh, the virus and the vaccine are causing disruption of the thymus gland leading to accelerated inflammation and um, increased uh, aging basically causing a uh, effect of uh, increasing your biological age. We look forward to seeing you at the conference. Thank you. Okay, hello everyone. My name is Rachel Jesse. I am a naturopath and nutritionist, and I've been working closely with long COVID patients from across the world for just over three years now. My presentation is going to focus on supporting the oral, nasal, and gut microbiome as a strategy to reduce spike replication in those key areas. I look forward to seeing you at the conference. Dear colleagues, my name is Hans Rausch, biologist, chemist and pharmacologist. I've done research on secondary substances, their analytics as well as their enzymatics on the university for a long time. And then in 1994, I opened my own testing and development laboratory called Phytochem in Germany. I am running this as CEO now already 29 years. In addition to European or Western phytomedicine, we also work mainly in the field of traditional Asian herbal medicine. At the moment, I'm working with my team on product development and optimization together with Joachim Gallach and Dr. Beate Jäger for nature-based intervention of COVID damages in humans. I am also happy to contribute my expertise to this circle of scientists and therapists. Thank you. Hello, my name is Dr. Kevin McCann. I'm a systems neuroscientist. I've been involved in investigations into SARS for um, three plus years now, particularly its laboratory origin, its overlap with uh, biowarfare and medical countermeasure industries. And I have a scientific interest in uh, one of the key mechanisms of the disease, which doesn't get talked about very often, which is um, amyloidosis, prions, and the, their impact in long COVID and neurodegeneration. Uh, I look forward to seeing you in August. My name is Dr. Beate Jäger from Germany. I'm a chief doctor in internal medicine and laboratory medicine. I am working with blood apheresis systems like the health system. I um, proposed this treatment as a possible solution to help long COVID patients and acute COVID patients and post-vac patients. Uh, moreover, we treat patients with um, anti-clotting substances. Our research focuses on um, clinical studies and we do flu fluorescent microscopy as well as other collaborations um, 
to improve our understanding of the disease and I feel pleased and honored to join this distinguished community and I'm looking forward to see you at the conference tomorrow. All the best. And a current member of Drastic investigating the origins of the SARS-CoV-2 virus. My talk will focus on my work in, one, quantifying the depth and breadth of scientific censorship around the origin of the virus and appropriate medical responses to it. Two, looking at the virus and the public health response to it through the prism of gain of function research. Three, highlighting specific evidence within epitopes of the viral genome that were specifically censored, which likely relate to long COVID PASC sequelae. And four, highlighting relevant new advances in epigenetics. I look forward to what will be a, a very important and very timely conference. Welcome, my name is Joachim Gerlach and I'm a German COVID-19 researcher and head of research at the Dysnos Biotech India. Uh, I will be speaking about um, long COVID and vaccine injuries, especially in the context of persistent spike and uh, the resulting disease expressions in neuro-COVID, immunodeficiency and um, clotting disorders, cardiovascular disease and immunodeficiency, which we all have published on and well researched because everybody in this conference I deem to be a groundbreaking researcher and have contributed massively to advance the field uh, in, in to advance uh, research and medical research in the field of COVID and non-COVID conditions. I'm looking forward to see you at the conference. Hi, I'm Dr. Robin Rose, CEO and founder of the Terrain Health Medical and Wellness Center. For the past two and a half years, we have been deeply committed to the care of patients with long hauler COVID, including those who are vaccine injured. We have spent countless hours collaborating with our research partners around the globe to develop novel common denominator protocols and personalized interventions for the treatment of long hauler COVID, always evolving in how we diagnose and treat as we learn more every day. The most recent addition to our armamentarium of protocols is the spike detox. We believe that this is a major game changer in how we approach the treatment of long hauler COVID and vaccine injured patients. Because we know access to care is limited, as well as finances for many patients that have bared the burden of this terrible disease, we have created the Buyers Club RX, a platform featuring diagnostic testing, state-of-the-art protocols, and consultation services that are all significantly discounted. It is our mission to reach the masses and test and treat as many of you as possible in a more economical fashion. At our conference, I will be focusing on the clinical applications of our protocols and outcomes, as well as diagnostic testing. Looking forward to seeing everyone at the conference the weekend of August 26. Hello, I'm Dr. Tina Pears. I work in the UK. I've been working with long COVID patients since November 2020 and have seen hundreds of patients with a particular uh, emphasis on the association between long COVID and mast cell activation syndrome. I really hope that you can join us at our conference in August. Hi, my name is Christy Grace. For the last few years, I've been a consultant and project and process manager designing projects for researchers all over the globe, both startups and top researchers, working with lipid nanoparticle and RNA to make things such as recombinant proteins, which include but not limited to monoclonal antibodies, fusion proteins, CRISPR-Cas9. I have also worked in the IVT space, plasmids, baculovirus, and with E. coli. I'll be presenting on issues, of course, with the RNA injections, lipid nanoparticle RNA, and then looking at the recent contamination concerns that McKernan and others have now recently verified with the plasmids, what that means to the human body, looking at a myriad of things such as what happened in cold chain, what happens with the zeta potential, 
positive negative charges, what we're looking at with flocculation, Oswald effect, ion bridging, and then what plasmids can exactly bind to in the human body and the SD40 promoter. Thanks so much for joining us and I look forward to seeing you all at the end of August for the conference. Thanks again. Hi, my name is Abdul Nangvi. I'm a member of a doctor practitioner of the world. My speciality is neurocovid and associated illnesses that affect the central nervous system. I'm a scientist from Pakistan. And in September 2023, that is three weeks from now, I'm going to join uh, the St. George's Hospital in uh, Bad Ebling, Germany, where I would work with Dr. Beati and uh, positioned as a senior scientist in the field of uh, neurological research. In the new conference series of 2023, I'll be talking uh, on the neurological effects of COVID and neurocovid in particular in, in long COVID patients. Also, we'll talk about uh, the effect of the mechanisms involved in spike protein role in the causation of microplots that are abnormal from by. Thank you very much. I, I look forward for your active participation and a uh, greater audience uh, in this event. Thank you very much.